What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. My name is Nora and thank you so much for watching. Before we jump into today's video, you already know what it is. Be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. Follow your girl on Instagram because you know we are growing the family across all platforms. So for today's video, um, I wanted to just kind of show you guys how I pack and prep for a little trip, a little weekend getaway. Um, a couple of my friends and I are traveling this weekend for Amber's birthday. By the time this video goes up, yeah, it'll probably be up tomorrow, Friday. I'm filming this on Thursday night. So happy birthday, Amber. I'm so excited to celebrate you this weekend. But yes, your girl's high maintenance. I like to make lists. I like to make sure I am on top of my packing. So I figured, girl just got back from the gym, shower, just had some dinner, enjoying a glass of wine. Got my, you know, waist trainer on, getting snatched, just wearing my skims. Uh, boxer shorts and then this uh, sports bra from Sean John, yeah, Sean John X Misguided. So, wanted to just take you guys along kind of how I prep, um, pack, organize, all that good stuff before I go out for a trip. Um, and yeah, this will kind of be vlog style, definitely not going to be a sit down video. Thought it would be kind of nice to switch it up a little bit. So, uh, let's jump right in. Y'all know I obviously have my YouTube videos going in the back. So right now I've just got some laundry going on first. Um, I didn't really need too many things in there. Like I needed a couple things. Um, yeah, I just got laundry going on here. Um, I didn't need too many things like that were dirty, but I do always like to make sure when I come back from a trip that everything is clean, even if I'm gone for just the weekend. Uh, we're literally leaving tomorrow, Friday after work, and then I'll be back early Monday. So um, I like to make sure the house and everything is organized, everything is clean. Um, I've got my suitcase out. It's just a small uh, little carry-on that I purchased from, um, I want to say Home Goods. Probably home goods. I got that a while ago. It's from uh, Kenneth Cole, but love that. It's like a perfect little size. Um, I just like to have something on wheels because I just think it's so much easier to uh, commute with, which I think, I don't know. I just don't like having duffel bags and so many different little small bags. I think it's really hard to kind of move around with. I just prefer having the suitcase. So have that already out and pretty much what I do, and let me just say, listen, my room is a mess, you guys, because again, your girl's prepping. So what I like to do before I travel, I do like to make a list and I make a list of everything I'm going to take down to toiletries. If I'm taking any electronics, my chargers, I just like to like make a list. Okay. And I just feel like it keeps me organized. It's a lot easier to pack. I don't overpack. I know exactly what I'm bringing. And I know for some people you're going to look at this and you're going to say, okay, girl, you're literally going for four days, three nights. We're going to kind of like a cabin house ish type of thing. And it's cold over here. And most of what we're going to be doing, honestly, is chilling in the house, playing games, drinking, enjoying each other's company. So I know for some people, when you guys see everything kind of pulled out, I'm just slowly pulling some things out now. But when you see everything pulled out, I know some people are going to say, sis, you brought a lot. But I promise me making the list keeps me on top of it. And I know exactly what I'm bringing. So I'll insert just like a little video clip right here so you guys can see, um, you know, just what I wrote down in my notes. And again, I do this for every trip, even if I'm going somewhere for like 36 hours, 48 hours, one night, I make a list so I know exactly what I'm bringing. And I like to break it down by day so I know exactly what outfits I'm wearing that day. Uh, if I'm shooting an outfit that day, you guys will see, I think it's on Saturday, I want to say it was, I wanted to shoot that look while we're there. So I'll know, okay, this is a shoot look. Um, I have a couple different outfit changes. I know a little high maintenance, but like I'm going to wear something, you know, during the day, a little bit more put together if I'm doing any work on my laptop, since we are still in vlogging. So I'll still be, uh, excuse me, vlogmas. I'll still be editing and recording and filming and all that good stuff. So um, I do have more like, I don't want to say dressy options, but just more put together looks. And then I have um, some more like chill fits. So it's just like lounge wear and like easy little like t-shirts and, and stuff like that. But I like to see it all mapped out and even down to like my sleepwear, my robe, all that good stuff. So I'm going to let this laundry uh, kind of work a little bit. And then uh, once I finish that, I will probably check in with you guys once I actually start putting things into the suitcase just so you can get an idea of how I pack all that stuff up. 
Now for my toiletries, those are probably the only things I don't necessarily pack the night before only because a lot of them um, I will still have to use first thing in the morning. But what I at least like to do and <laughs> I ain't gonna hold y'all with my OCD. It does kind of sometimes like aggravate the hell out of me just because it's all on the counter. But I do at least like to make sure that I can start pulling everything out. That way I know what I'm taking with me. And if I am gonna forget, if I'm gonna forget anything or even close to forgetting anything, this is when I can kind of recap. I just kind of start pulling all these products here. Um, I've got my washcloths there and I replenish them obviously over time, but I can just grab a washcloth there to take with me. Um, and then what I will do is obviously like my toothbrushes there. And then I keep a nice little stash right here of like a lot of my uh, travel size things that I just, I don't know, I just like to pick them up over time. I spend a lot of time in the little travel section. I just like many things like, look how cute she is. You know what I mean? Like I just love many things. So I just kind of come here, go through all of like my travel size stuff just so I make sure I have like my mouthwash, my toothpaste, um, I've got like any other skincare things that I need. I kind of keep all that stuff in here. And then again, I just make sure all of it is on the countertop so that tomorrow morning when I finish using them, I can just go ahead and pack all that stuff up. All right, so most of the laundry is done now. I just had a couple more things that I needed to uh, finish like drying off right now. It's not anything that I'm taking with me. It's just stuff that needs to be washed. But um, so yeah, I pretty much have everything laid out right here that I am taking with me. Um, obviously you guys saw already my list. So pretty much now I am just going to get to packing. Um, obviously I showed you guys my suitcase already. So uh, just gonna set that up and let you guys watch me do that. So I like to pack all of my clothes on this side just because this has like the zippered closure. I feel like it does a better job of keeping everything nice and tightly packed. And what I always do is make sure, now obviously I know this is not rocket science, a lot of you probably already do this, but hey, I figured why not share. I do like to roll all of my clothes and just place them into the suitcase. Now, I try to make sure I'm rolling outfits together, anything that, you know, tops that are gonna go with certain bottoms, I like to make sure those are all in there. Now, some of these pieces I might not be able to all roll in here just because again, it is colder, so, some things are definitely going to take a lot more space than others. So I am just going to try to roll and fit as much as I can. If I have to lay some things on top, I'll lay it on top as well. We've been waiting all year for this night. Oh, yeah. When the snow is twisting on the trees outside. And all the stockings are hung by the fireside. Oh, yeah. Waiting for a Santa to So that just keeps that nicely tight and packed. As you guys can saw, I probably just fit, honestly, six different like outfits, tops and bottoms, all three of my different things to sleep in. Yes, I'm high maintenance. I love my skim stuff. So I bring three different things to sleep the entire weekend. We'll be here for three nights. And then I just have um, one more hoodie that I'm gonna throw in here. Now, normally on this side, I would also throw in, oh, let me grab them real quick my air forces just because those are the only other pairs of shoes that i will probably change into um the other shoes that i'm going to bring with me i'm going to wear on our way there and honestly most of the time while we're there i'm going to wear that anyways and then over here is really just going to be um like my toiletries skincare and stuff which is like super easy and that doesn't take a lot of space what's going to help me with this trip as well uh just because i mean we are going to pretty much be in like a cabin um i'm not packing any makeup so i can you know kind of fit some things in here and all of that stuff will be able to fit nicely on that side and i will um add that in probably in the morning but um you know maybe just to make sure everything fits i'll probably try to slide that in there as well i did forget that i was just going to throw uh like underwear and socks and bras and stuff in there so i'm just going to put that here and then again like i mentioned i know i was saying before that i was going to show you guys now but I'm not just because I'm going to add that stuff in in the morning since that's when I uh, will be done using all of my skincare and stuff. But I promise you it fits perfectly because again, it's not that much. It will literally just sit right on top of here and I'll be able to 
just fasten this, keeps it all in place. And then we close it up and we are ready to go. And I know like some people might look at this and think this is such a small suitcase, but it's perfect. It literally fits everything, closes no issues. It is on four wheels, so it's super easy to travel with. And this just makes everything easy. And uh, yeah, that's literally all my clothes for the entire weekend. And all right, you guys, that is it for today's video. I hope you all enjoyed that. Um, I am actually gonna jump into editing this video now to make sure that it is up on time for tomorrow. Um, but hopefully you guys have been enjoying Vlogmas thus far. We are almost done. I think tomorrow we are gonna be in Vlogmas day 18. One more week, you guys. Home stretch, home stretch. Uh, but hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Again, be sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I will see you guys in tomorrow's video for another day of Vlogmas. Bye, guys. Uh,